Hot Springs police are revisiting a cold case from six years ago where a young woman was found dead in her apartment. KRK Force Caitlin Reardon was in the spa city today talking with police about the details of this case. It's like somebody's really getting away with murder. You don't want somebody to get away with murder. Police can't say how 20-year-old Katie Lavender was killed, but they know somebody is responsible for her death. Absolutely homicide, without a doubt. Lavender was from Hot Springs, and according to police, walked almost everywhere she went. But maybe not on that March night back in 2013. On the night that she was killed, that Katie possibly got into a white four-door passenger car in front of Oaklawn. Police say the next morning she was found by her boyfriend, dead in her apartment on Higdon Ferry Road. That was the same year Emily Hale moved to Hot Springs. That's strange to me that, that no one has heard anything or seen anything that... You know, that someone ends up dead in their apartment and, no, and they're murdered and no one knows anything. Police say for six years they've followed every lead, but now are at a dead end. At this point, with what we have, we cannot rule anybody out. We think it was my Katie New. Unsweet without. I just would like to think that nobody would get away with something like that. If you know anything or remember anything about Katie, the suspect car, or potentially seeing her that night, be sure to give Hot Springs Police a call.